One year ago, a class of athletes in Beulah seized their junior year, winning both the Class B basketball and baseball tournaments. This past Sunday, as seniors, that class graduated, and both their athletic and academic futures look bright. All nine are headed to college, and four will continue to participate in athletics at the next level. Baseball at MSU Moorhead, basketball at the South Dakota School of Mines, football at the University of Mary, and baseball at Williston State. But as a group, those seniors and the rest of the minors baseball team still has a chance to add to their legacy. A full year has passed since a trio of talented outfielders were named to the all-tournament team after leading the minors to the 2012 baseball title. All three are back, led by 2012 All-State selection Trevor Zacker, who is paired with Cody Nelson as the team's pair of ace hurlers. Nelson says the goal for this year was simple. Of course we wanted to repeat for a team goal, yeah. Miners coach Bob Cook, who was named the Region 8 Coach of the Year, wasn't putting the cart before the horse. The goal was to win a region championship the regular season, then win the region tournament, get back to the state tournament. A change this year moved the Miners to Region 8, but the team cruised to another championship and state tournament berth, winning two games by a combined score of 18 to 1. The new region brought new challenges, but Beulah was able to handle them. I thought this region um, was solid top to bottom. Um, both regions are really tough. You need to come from a region where you got Velva and of course Hazen was with us. Um, Central McLean, Garrison, you know, it was, it was a tough region. But I, I really think this region might have been a little bit tougher. Just uh, top to bottom, um, the teams are so tough. I mean, you never knew when a game was over because they, they kept coming after you. The Miners have a 48-6 record over the last two seasons, but Coach Cook knew this was a special group years ago. Actually, I noticed that these guys were going to be pretty good. It was their last year Babe Ruth. Most of them are on the, Babe, the older Babe Ruth team. Um, there were a couple of guys who were already playing Legion baseball, so it wasn't a complete team yet. I mean, there were just a few of them up on the Legion level, and they got beat by Hazen in the, the, region, in the Babe Ruth championship, I believe it was. But I could already see then that we had some guys, and if they could develop, take the next step, that we were going to be pretty solid as far as pitching all the way through. And, you know, they put the work in, and it's, it's, they definitely have developed themselves. They've done a good job. A return trip to state is not something the miners are taking lightly. These boys either played in or watched as the unthinkable happened during their school's other chance to repeat. Just three months ago, after an undefeated regular season for the Beulah basketball team, the top-ranked miners were upset in the region championship. Maybe that's why Cody Nelson isn't ready to compare this year's team to last year's. Well, uh... Um, maybe we should answer that question after uh, the state tournament, but I don't know, we play really well together. We all have good bonds and we're really good teammates. While the record is impressive and the play of the team has been tough to match, the Miners need this last chance. There's still one part of winning they've yet to perfect. For the Beck Sports Network, I'm John Haddon.